Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to enable USB ports if you're experiencing issues with some of your USB ports perhaps not being detected on Windows 10. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by heading over to the Start menu and you're going to left click on it. And then once you're on the Start menu, you want to type in Troubleshoot. The best match it comes up it should say troubleshooting. So you want to left click on that. On the left side here, underneath control panel home, you want to left click on this view all button right here. You want to left click on the button that says hardware and devices on the left side. This will troubleshoot and help prevent computer problems with hardware and devices. So you want to left click on next. Just be patient, this will take a couple moments. If you receive any suggestions, you want to proceed. So in this case, it wants to install device settings. We want to enable this. You might get a different pop-up, or you might not get anything at all. You just want to proceed and allow Windows to correct any problems that it finds. So it says troubleshooting has completed. The troubleshoot made some changes to your system. It might not find issues in your case. In that event, I would recommend running different diagnostic tools on the USB device itself and make sure that the USB port is more than likely not corrupt or bad. So in that case, there's other troubleshooting methods you can go into. But this is a good overview, just one quick tool you can run that should hopefully fix most common problems. So, I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.